So the next thing on my list is, oh my gosh, I just passed a level nine. <gasps> One more level until you beat the vlog game. Okay, so as I was saying, Low battery, are you are you serious? Like, I'm one level away. I'm one level away from beating the vlogging. Please, just give me five more minutes, Mr. Camera. Please, no! Hey guys, it's Tessa. Today, I'll be showing you how to level up quicker in Bloxburg and get to max level in working in no time. So if you have no idea what I'm talking about, basically, when you work in Bloxburg, there's a point system and there's a leveling system and you get promoted every so often and the max is level 50. If you're excited for this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe because only around 1% of you are subscribed. So yeah, let's get started. By the way, you might have noticed that I did not do question of the video on this video and I'll explain a little later why that is. So the job that I am at the highest level of is delivery person and I'm in level 35. So I'd say level 35 is pretty high. Obviously there are some people that is watching this video that is higher than me, but I feel like level 35, like I make a decent amount of money. And be sure to watch until the end because I have some pretty good tips, which is definitely going to help you. By the way, this house is like so cute. If you haven't watched Tuesday's video, it's like the cutest house I've ever made. Like I really want to go to the beach now. So the first tip is to set a goal for yourself of when you want yourself to level up. So I know I said this in a previous video about like goal setting and setting yourself a budget, but honestly, like goal setting is so helpful. So even though I'm talking about a video game, like the tip I'm giving you right now, goal setting can literally benefit your life. That's how good my channel is, you know, it's so good. No, I'm just kidding. So how this works is you're going to give yourself a goal of when you want to level up, depending on how often you work, and what level you are in. So you can tell yourself, oh, I'm gonna level up every three days and I get to role play with my friend every time I do level up or something. So you can give yourself a little reward when you level up to motivate and give you the incentive to work. So the second tip is to don't look at your points when you work. So if you don't know what points are, points are basically how far you are away from leveling up. So I am in 797 points and I need to get to 1,235 points to get to the next level. And by the way, the higher your level is, it takes longer for you to level up because it takes more points. And the reason I'm saying this is because when you do look at your points, they seem to go slower. You're looking at it, so you see like, oh, two points, two points, two points, two points. So with this tip, what I'm hoping that you're gonna do is you're gonna hide your points and then before you look at your points, you're gonna go like, okay, well, I'm gonna work one more pizza, I'm gonna work one more pizza so that you do get like two more points right before you look at it. Like, okay, I'm gonna work one more again. And then just keep on building up on top of that. And the reason I'm saying deliver a pizza is because most people do work at the pizza delivery job as it is the most high paying job and the most popular job. So finally, you do look at your points and you're like, oh my gosh, I just gained 80 points. I'm only 10 points away from a promotion. Like, what the heck? So then what I hope happens is that you see how many points you just gained and you're like, I gotta work more, I gotta get that 10 points. And your own achievement is basically motivating yourself to work even more. I'm sticking a lot, by the way. So I put a poll on my community post asking if I should do shout outs and the majority of people did say yes. Basically, there are two ways to be entered to be shout outs of the week. So the first way is to comment a secret word for each video and I'll tell you which word. Speaking of the secret word, the secret word for this video is pizza because I love pizza and this is pizza kind of pizza delivery related. So comment down below that and like the video and subscribe to my channel and that's it, you're entered. So the second way is through Roblox donations and how this is going to work is in my description. I have a link that says support me Roblox donations and you can donate me Roblox through that. So all the Robux that gets donated will go straight to my YouTube videos to enhance, enhance, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, but it will improve um, your watching experience to make it more enjoyable. I also do wanna raise enough Robux to afford a neighborhood because I do wanna have a neighborhood for events that I wanna host soon. So I also do wanna make a group and change my Roblox username to Xreali so that's easier for people to find me 
and join my game if they want to. My username right now is curlpower123, which is kind of hard to remember. So right now I only have around like 9,000 to 10,000 subscribers compared to other YouTubers. You get a pretty high chance of getting shouted out and there's two methods. So if you do both ways, you get even more chance of getting shouted out. So the third way is to get the Exla Employee Game Pass. And I've said this in a previous video, but I had like 23 subscribers at when I made that video. So honestly, like, I'm pretty sure most of you didn't watch it. So one of the perks of getting this game pass is that you double the points you get per pizza you deliver. And I'll show you what I mean right now. And I'm gonna do the exact same thing that I did in my previous video because there's really no other way to do this. So here I have a pizza and I'm going to deliver it. Hopefully this is not too far. I think it's kind of far, oh no. So as you can see right now, I have 797 points. So without the Excel Employee Game Pass, when I deliver this pizza, I will get two points and I'll go to 799. But if I do deliver this pizza, and I do have the Excel Employee Game Pass, by the way, if I do deliver this pizza, I go to 801 instead of 799 because I double the points I get. And so instead of getting two points, I get four points. And by the way, every job is different. So with pizza delivery, I get two points per delivery, but I'm pretty sure like cashiers and some other jobs, you only get one point. And if you do get the Excel Employee Game Pass, you only, you get two points instead of four. So what this means is you can level up in half the time and you get to max level in half the time. You also get more money per pizza. So that's like a win-win situation. Obviously you do need 300 Robux for this Game Pass, which is on the higher end of blocks for Game Passes. But I really think this Game Pass is worth it. It's like the best Game Pass in blocks. So the next way is to work longer and this is super obvious but the question here is how do you work longer? So the way to do this is to motivate yourself to work but the next question is how do I motivate myself to work? So I've said this in a previous video but the way is to do something you like while you're working. And by the way, the video that I keep on referring to is this video right here. So you can like watch YouTube, listen to music, talk to a friend, whatever it is, you gotta do it because that's what's going to motivate you to work longer. Motivation is such a big part of our lives because if you don't wanna do it or you don't like, you probably won't do it unless it's a piece of homework and you kind of have to do it. So this is episode four of my money making series and if you haven't watched episode one, two, and three, you probably should go check those out because they teach you how to make money without working and also how to save money so you don't go broke. So I'll link the playlist right over there. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up and hit the red button down below to subscribe. Hit the bell icon beside you so you'll never miss a future upload. And yeah, thanks for watching.